once again to Tawi Tawi COVID-19 Bulletin. Here we're going to give you updates, advisories, and information about the COVID-19 pandemic and what we are doing dito sa province ng Tawi Tawi. First things first, I'd like to apologize for not uploading sooner but as you well know, wala tayong signal dito sa Tawi Tawi for the past 4 or 5 days. Kaya medyo na-delay tayo ngayon. So info lang tayo sa mga tao na outside of Tawi-Tawi. Noong June 11, nawalan kami ng globe signal dito for the past how many days? Tapit of naman, si Smart naman ayaw magpatalo. Well, erratic naman yung kanyang internet connection for the past how many days din until now. And as for the reason kung bakit nga ganito yung mga internet connections natin tsaka mobile connections, well, your guess is as good as mine. Kasi wala namang official statement na pinalabas si Globe or either si Smart. So with that out of the way, let's go now to the COVID-19 bulletin. And I'd like everyone to know that this data that has been collected here has been updated until June 16, 2021. So from June 10 to June 15, 2021, Tawi Tawi IATF has recorded 5 new cases, pushing our total cases to 245. So to date, we have 20 active cases, 211 total recoveries, 14 fatalities, and 2,925 tests done in the province of Tawi Tawi. Breaking the cases into total cases by island municipality, we have 188 cases for Bongao. Municipality of Panglima Sugala with 14 cases. Municipality of Sitangkay with 9 cases. Municipality of Turtle Island with 6 COVID cases. Municipality of Mapun with 4 cases. Municipality of Sibuto with 6 COVID cases. Municipality of Simunul with 5 COVID cases. Municipality of Languyan with 2 cases Municipality of South of Bian and the island of Tabawan, 4 cases Municipality of Sapa Sapa with 6 COVID cases And the Municipality of Tandubas with 1 COVID case Please take note that this data is from the Tawi Tawi IATF COVID-19 Situation Report dated from June 10 to June 15, 2021 As for advisories, there are no new guidelines by the Bongao Task Force COVID-19. So guidelines are set on the June 4, 2021 advisory update. Restaurants and other food establishments remain open for dine-in as well as takeout provided dining customers shall not exceed the mandated 30% maximum capacity limit as well as to provide hand washing facilities and sanitizers. Other establishments shall accommodate customers for 50% of the store's capacity to ensure social distancing and safety health protocols. For everyone's information, face masks and face shields are now mandatory and must be worn at these establishments. For more information, please visit the Municipality of Bongao Facebook page. Vaccinations are now underway in the province of Tawi Tawi as seen by the RHU Bongao Facebook posts. For now, vaccinations are available for priority groups A1, A2, and A3. For priority group A4, they are available for pre-listing. So, anong priority group kayo listed? Kung nagtatrabaho kayo sa frontline health services, then your priority group A1. If you're 59 years old and above, then your priority group A2. If you're a patient with comorbidities or two or more sickness, then your priority group A3. Kung non-medical frontline personnel ka sa mahalagang sectors like ministries and the local government and kasama na ang uniform personnel like police at ang armed forces, then your priority group A4. To explain in detail sa priority group A3, if you're 18 to 59 years old with any clinically controlled comorbidities that are listed below, then you are considered priority group A3. So to elaborate further ang priority group A4, kung example, worker ka sa private sector, public sector, katulad ng local government and provincial government, and of course kapag sa informal sector ka, nakitinda ka ng mga pagkain or meron kang tindahan sa market, then kasali po kayo ng 
priority group A4. So info lang sa ating mga priority groups A1 to A4. Kung gusto magparegister for master listing, punta lang po tayo sa RHU Bongao Health Center which is open from Monday to Fridays, 8 o'clock to 5 p.m. Senior citizens naman na hindi pa nagpa-vaccinate, pwede niyong puntaan ng inyong mga barangay health workers sa barangay for registration or you could also text yung number listed dito, complete with your name, your age, your sex, your cell phone number, tsaka yung address niyo para mapuntahan kayo. For more information, please contact the Bongao Health Center Facebook page para updated po tayo sa mga things na kailangan nating gawin for vaccination. So guys, do your part. Get vaccinated and save a life. So that's all the updates we have for today, dated June 17, 2021. For more information and new updates, please visit these following Facebook pages. Municipality of Bungao Facebook page, IATF Tawi Tawi Facebook page, RHU Bungao Facebook page, Province of Tawi Tawi Facebook page. If you haven't already, please join the group Bongao Tawi Tawi News and Bongao Tawi Tawi Group for you to stay updated on the goings on of the province. So thank you once again. This is Jeff Fabian in the Tawi Tawi COVID-19 Bulletin. So get vaccinated, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.